put that one on there. Okay. So I met Barbara a long time ago. How long ago, Barbara? Do you want to come up here and talk for a minute? No. A lot of these people don't know who you are. And I think they're going to love when I tell them who you are. I'm going to tell them exactly who you are. Do you, you, you want to stay down there when I do it or do you want to come up here? You stay right there. So Barbara knew Elvis in the 50s. Very well. She's been on the back of his motorcycle. She's drove him. Am I wrong? As far as the motorcycles, Barbara, then you said the bad thing, and that just, whoosh. Barbara knew Elvis back in the 50s, before he ever had Graceland, you know, the house in Audubon Drive? She's been in his bed, she said it. But he would play his records for you, and say, Barbara, what do you think about this one? Why aren't, why aren't they telling this? Hey, let me speak. What is, no, the piano, he's played... Every night, I was, Barbara was very special. And you have to remember, I'm you come up here and talk. I'm going to live from sundown to sunup, and I just lived that way. And we just go, and that was pretty every morning. Yes, Barbara, that is so special. And let me tell you what. Yeah. And I've met a lot of wild women. Mm -hmm. And I've met a lot of people that have stories, right? And I'm like, I met Barbara and I went, huh, yeah. what if she's a crazy, you know? <laughs> well, you never know, you don't know people. Until she pulled out pictures, original photos of her sitting on Elvis's lap. Ooh. You know, this woman right here is, that, there's a reason why you're front and center, Barbara, and I'm so glad to know you. Barbara, will you quit complimenting me? I'm trying to have a moment here. <laughs> Barbara, we love you, so. Guys, Barbara.